It's a humanitarian disaster that sent thousands of refugees fleeing Syria into neighboring numerous European countries. But some of those Syrian refugees will wind up in the United States by the end of next year. And there's a group here in Austin that will help get them settled. KXA and Sophia Beausoleil spoke today with one man who's helping those families in the area. I've been in their shoes to the clients that I'm working with. Katan Mustafa came to Texas as an Iraqi refugee seven years ago. Now he works for the same program which helped him. So I feel like it's my turn now to repay uh, that favor. Katan has worked with four Syrian families who've moved to Austin so far. All of them, they have lost houses, jobs, unfortunately, and they left everything behind. Refugee Services of Texas expects up to 150 Syrians to call Central Texas home by next year. They're just looking for a place to live in peace and security. Aaron Rippenkroger is the CEO for the Refugee Services of Texas and says it takes a while before refugees are even placed in different cities because of extensive background checks. Rippenkroger says people shouldn't get caught up in the rhetoric or fear refugees in their backyard. But you know immediately when you meet them that this person is the furthest thing from a terrorist that you could possibly imagine. I mean, these people are really running away from a war and uh, have no interest in participating in anything like that. He says they just want better lives for their families. And these are folks that are going to be self-sufficient in a pretty short time frame and then be contributing back to the growth and success story that Texas is today. Success stories like Catan, who hopes to pay it forward to other refugees. Sophia Bosley, KXAN News. Officials expect 1,700 more refugees to be living in the United States before the end of this year. The number of Syrians in Austin will go up by next spring.